when the human intellect is applied seriously for a long time continuously the dullness comes now when then you take your glasses and wipe it and then reboot it why after some time it becomes a little dim the clarity is gone pandit ravi shankar between each music have you seen him he has to retune because the strings are become a little loose which is so sensitive he only can understand it and refits it very often the teachers do it in the scriptural literature shock the man to wake him up internally his mental and intellectual personality such a electric probe a bull or a cow has been touched it will not stop running why a shock is <laughs> a probe there's a stick with a battery down below switch on and touch the fellow that will do similarly a shock therapy is given so what the teacher says gnanam knowledge is no blur than practice so practice is lower gnanam is higher did i hear properly because hinduism always says practice 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 you must yourself reach there there is nobody else can take you 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 are some the student said something wrong with the teacher he is contradicting then the teacher gives the second lash shock what knowledge is nothing jnana is more important so don't worry about the book knowledge don't worry about practicing ha ah! sit down dhyana transcendental <laughs> dhyana also is nothing really speaking dhyana is nothing what is the nobler karma bhala tyaga karma bhala tyaga learn the art of working in the world outside without any worry and anxiety of the fruits there are that is the noblest to if you want next to come study last comes to pet thing called practice the student has all the sympathy with the teacher now he is convinced that the poor teacher has gone off the head because this is not what the rishis have said in the rishis or the all the upanishads and the scriptures that he have studied so far suddenly the teacher says when you give up your anxiety for the fruits of action immediately the mind becomes relatively quiet because your anxiety for the future is ended when the mind has become quiet you have the ability to contemplate when you got the ability to contemplate your study of the textbooks becomes really efficient you are not studying the book word meaning but the significance of it when you have thus understood the shastra your practice becomes day by day productive of results because you know what you are doing why you are doing what is the where am i must my attention be riveted when you have not got the knowledge you do it japa is a japa yoga is among the yogas i am the japa yoga bhagwan has said catch on a mala rotate it ram 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 you know which is faster we don't know ram 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 after 10 years the mala is polished not the individual <laughs> individual is again sharp corner as everybody why you don't know where you have to fix up the mind why you are doing it hey with the knowledge the abhyas becomes productive of resources you can schedule your progress when you have got the knowledge you must have the ability to see through it the significance of it you must be able to contemplate upon it that dhyana shakti dhyana shakti cannot be when the mind is constantly dissipating itself the anxiety for the future 